All right, so we're only a few hours into this game, and I got to tell you that I have been blown away by not only the support of my videos. We did, like, the first two parts. They did well. If you want more of this game, just keep all like support. Uh, but the game itself is so well done. Combat's amazing. The cutscenes, the story, the character building, everything about it. I mean, the combat's just so much fun. I could, like... I don't know. Comparing it to, like, Final Fantasy VII Remake, it felt more... Not as free-flowing in that game, you know? But it was still fun. This is, like, miles better. It's so good. But anyways, love you all. If you want more of this game, quickly just keep it up. Let's go ahead and get this. So much for arriving before sunset. <sighs> I didn't realize we were this close. Any idea what that is they built the village around? The Fallen Ruin. I've heard some call it an airship. Though its flying days seem to be behind it. It's a shame, that. You truly think a dominant's waiting for us in that village? My scout has never given me any reason to doubt him. Which is why I think we should hurry. Come on. All right, obelisks to see. World map, local map. Basically a fast travel point. So I'm guessing this area... Louder than words. Wasn't there a song called that recently? <laughs> this isn't the first time I've seen one of these. Perhaps I can use them as way marks. Area is pretty dark. Uh, I might increase the brightness eventually, but I've been adding some like brightness filters. But now I'm sprinting. Did I just run into something? I don't know. Like I'm going extra fast right now. Figures up ahead. Are they friends or foes? I hope we're fighting. I see a health bar. You. I'm going in. Where do they all come from? Another. Get a point. It's over. You know Some of the best combat in any game in forever. I'm not even trying to really describe it. It's free flowing. I mean, I just feel like I can see it maybe getting overwhelming if you're like fighting a ton of enemies. But you have abilities that kind of go after all of them sometimes. Okay, I thought I was far enough away. Hold on. Sick of toggle. Wait, they climbed up. Oh, how you doing? More were losers. But why? What is it they want? You're welcome to ask the next ones we meet. Let me know how it goes. If you can replay the encounters in this game like that, I kind of wonder, does that mean like it's like The Last of Us where you can just replay different areas where you're fighting enemies? All right, quest destination nearby. Here we go. No sign of the royalists. Or anyone else for that matter. It's too bloody quiet. Even for this hour. What do we do now? First we look for my scout. You start here, I'll circle round the back. How do I let you know if I find him? Good question. Shout? Subtle. That. Oh, a fashionable that. point. Got it. So this area must be pretty big if we're going to be having a lot of points where we can fast travel around. Wish it wasn't so dark. I mean, 
I know it's like that for the story, but you miss me. I'm flattered, but let's stick to the plan, eh? <laughs> what? It sounds like a child. Here's what's crazy. I increased the brightness to like almost every game has a default of 50, right? I usually go to 60. If it's a horror game, I go to 70 sometimes. It's all right. I'm not one of them. My friend and I win. With the Imperial Army. And we've come to help. Do you know where your parents are? In... In the church. Then I'm going to find them. And make sure they're safe. Can you stay hidden here? Until then. To the church, then. We're going up here. This man's gonna die if we don't get into a healer. Enough of your barking, dog! About time. Stand back. Who the hell are you? Clive! Thought you weren't coming. You still alive, Gav? <laughs> Barely. Been doing what I can for the villagers, but... I thought you were joking. It's all right. He's with me. Is this everyone? No. There were others. A pair of royalists came for the bearers just before you arrived. Was a dominant among them? Maybe. It's not like he was holding a sign. I'll give you one guess where he's going. Clive, after him. All right, we're in hot pursuit. Let's get this. Sometimes the character just sprints like really fast when we're out in the wild, but like, right now this is my top speed. I didn't do anything different. I think it's an automatic thing in this game. I think combat's that way so you can get the dodging down, you know? Any word from the scouts? <laughs> Not yet, my lady, but we are the dominant companion. It's only a matter of time before we seize our quarry. Very good. And what of the others? The bearers have been taken to Cair Norvent. Some may still be worth keeping should the Dominant elude us. All is in hand, my lady. They will not be spoiled. I give you my word. <laughs> Gentlemen, a toast! Will you join me? <laughs> My thanks. Uh, hey. To our lady of the wind. And the king! Hey. Uh, the Imperials drink this piss? Well, it would go some way to explain their breath. <laughs> <laughs> lady Benedicta, Imperials! And instead of killing them, you lead the rat straight to us. Mercy! <laughs> Look 
look what we have here, boys. An Imperial Bearer. Good. I was getting bored. Oh my goodness! If this means what I think it does, then Sid has some explaining to do. Don't let them get away! I'm gonna do my jump attacks here. There, boy! I like how she kind of just stared at him as she did all that too during the cutscene. That was pretty cool. And before I get the stagger meter, like, all the way gone, I guess I'll... Health bar is almost there now. Oh no! Oh, come on. Not too far away. Of course it is. I feel like I should just use magic almost. You better be on your way, Sid. Too slow. Uh oh, here we go. Big damage, big damage. You know what to do. Sid can toggle. There we go. That was a really cool fight. Wait, what does this do? All right. I need to put the other one on too for the attack. I always forget. I may take off defense and put on the attack and the healing. Use those two for a little bit. And the automatic thing. You've got some fight in you. Even for a branded. <laughs> Clive! <laughs> Look who's here to save the day. Is this how you recruit all of your charges? Don't recall you complaining, Benedicta. So... Sidolphus, remind me, why was it that you betrayed your kingdom? I asked you a question, Lord Commander. Why? Because I'd had enough of you and your king's antics. And yet here you are, stealing my branded. What are you plotting? As if I'd tell you. Lady Benedicta, we have secured the dominant. Holy oh, something is there. And she's gone. Did she 
say where she was going? No. Then we head back to Lost Wing. One of the villagers may have heard something. But we can't just... Which is why I sent Gav. The man has a nose for these things. Trust me. at all. They were looking for a dominant. Yeah, that's right. Thought we were hiding the bastard. Like any of us would keep a monster like that under our roof. Oh, no offence. When no one talked, they started rounding up everyone with a brain. And then everyone without one and all. And locked you in the cellar, hoping sooner or later someone would break. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> you know... Things might have been different if you'd accepted my invitation. Oh, don't remind us. We were all saying the yeah. same thing. Yeah. This is our home, innit? Yeah. Don't mean we won't out when we can, though. And that, I'll drink to. Oh, come hear the tale of Lord D on the board. Whose tamed worms a thousand and slain the tenfold. One hundred full legions the young dragoon led And watched as a million foes turned tail and fled His lance levels mountains, it spanned as the deep The skies over storm breaks for Clive. And shoot the Revenge won't bring him back. It won't. Thirteen years ago, I watched a dominant kill my brother right in front of me, and I did nothing. But now I can. I can kill the son of a bitch, and bring peace to my brother's soul. After that, whatever happens, happens. Fate. You're content to be a slave, then. His radiance would have us believe the Imperial host invincible. Yet here we find the Empire's cornerstone teetering on the backs of a handful of cowards and cutthroats. <laughs> While Bahamut may lead a hundred full legions, could it be that the young prince defends a house of cards ready to topple at the slightest breeze? Tell me something. Why do you not resist? Within you lies the power to slay gods. The phoenix perished in your flames. Yet you do not fight. You do not flee. You refuse your gift. Perhaps you are distracted. <sighs> Offer still stands. Join us, and you will be treated with the respect one of our kind deserves. Lord Margrace, don't. I'll give you a moment to consider your options. Do be gentle with them.
alive. <laughs> Wake up. Gav's back. Canovent. One of the Empire's outlying strongholds. Though apparently not strong enough to keep out the Royalists. The captured bearers are inside. I'm sure of it. If Benedicta's orders are to stay in the shadows, she won't be traveling with many men. Meaning, she'll be keeping her prisoners together and close by. Including the Dominant. So, we find a way into the fortress and conjure a bit of chaos. Uh, what about me? Excellent question, Gav. You will wait outside the care and guide those I free to safety. And miss all the fun? Why can't he do that? Clive doesn't have your nose. He'd stumble off a cliff before he even found the men. Come on, Gav. You're the best man for the job. Well... When you put it that way... <sighs> suppose I'd better scout ahead for any surprises. Don't you let him down. I won't. All right. Shall we? Not so fast. We wait until tomorrow. But he's right there. And if we leave now, we'll arrive just as the sun comes up. Maybe join the guards in breaking their fast. Come on, Clive. They only just took the place. They'll be there a while yet. We've got one chance at this. You don't want to waste it, do you? No. Sort of, hold on, I gotta check something really quick because it's been bothering me. Oh, I haven't used any of my ability points and stuff. I just realized that. Well, that's not what was bothering me, but let's go ahead and use this. All right, well, this. So I'm guessing you got like the attack power, and then the other thing is a symbol for. I don't see a legend any anywhere, but I'm guessing it's like a stun meter type. This does so much already. Like, hold on. Both of these are good so what is this exactly closes the gap so what would it what would it even help I don't really get that maybe the follow-up attack all right do we have all these other abilities unlocked except obviously we can increase that's what I've been doing okay you know what maybe we go after this because I like this combo and it seems to do a lot of damage but ooh. That's, oh, that looks nice. Yeah, I've been doing that, but not to that extent. That's the lunge, the downward thrust, which, you know, whatever. I don't know a good opportunity to use that. Okay, here's what we do. I think we... I don't know, I'm torn. It's like, I want to go after... This one, probably. We'll save the other 400. I'll increase the damage. I'll probably increase this next. Sorry from the menu for too long. All right, here we go. Quest destination nearby. Here we go. Quentin, my good man. It seems we'll be spending the night. I thought as much. Where do you find that one? Oh, him. You won't believe me if I told you. Quentin here is an old friend. One who is sympathetic to our cause. Sympathetic? And he knows about your little sanctuary. I would never have guessed so many people were bent on setting us free. When last I checked, the mere thought would only a trip to the gallows. I am well aware of the risks, as I am of the rewards. And what could be more rewarding than your very own dominant of fire? A dominant? Here? Now that I would like to see. <sighs> Meaning you haven't. 
No, but nothing passes unnoticed in Lost Wing. Take your brand, for example. People will see that at once. And I need hardly tell you how they will greet the inquiries of a bearer. You are afraid your words will fall on deaf ears, as they have ever since the moment you were marked. Happily, I can provide a solution to your dilemma. As a favor to Sid, that is. Take this. You will find it has the uncanny power to loosen tongues. May the mothers guide you. This might be Imperial Land, but here in Lost Wing, it's his word that's law. But how? You don't need to worry about that just yet. Trust me. Everyone in Lost Wing knows what that seal means, and what it means if they don't take note. Now we can sit here counting our blessings, or put them to good use and find that dominance. Your choice. this thing really works so we got a sill obtained hold on we got some other stuff i wanted to check out um if anything else here we have some of these that increase like attack power okay healing potency let's get this one it does the attack and i think i'm good on everything else maybe the healing for 20 percent is better than the defense by 10 but it is what it is you know it's weird i'm playing a performance mode but it does feel a little stuttery around the town area That a hanged man, I see. Master Quentin must think you're important. It was a good thing you done today, getting rid of those bastards. If you hadn't come when you did, I'd be on my way to Ash by now, along with the others. Poor buggers. These others, was there a dominant among them? A dominant of fire? Might have been, yeah. Royalists seem to think there was, anyhow. A thin bloke all swallowed up in his robes like one of great Grieger's churchmen. Do you recall anything else about him? Only that he weren't alone. It was a young maid who went wherever he did. Including the church. And wherever the royalists dragged them both off to before you got here. I see. Thank you. Alright, gather information's one out of two done. I feel like I made check. I, my game should be in performance mode, but I feel like the frames are suffering a lot right here. Overall, the game's been fantastic. Now, the review scores came in right when I ended that last video. I saw the scores, and they were like 9 out of 10, 10 out of 10. Exactly what I was expecting. Well deserved, too. Ah. Master Quinton took a lark into you, I see. And there I was, thinking you were in bed with Sid. Wonder what Gav will have to say about this. Speaking of whom, if you see him, tell him thanks for looking after us. Now, what can I help you with? I'm searching for a dominant of fire. Gav seems to think he might have taken refuge here. We see a lot bearers around these parts. But I do seem to recall one who commanded the flame. Now, whether or not that makes him a dominant, I can't say. But the Waludas certainly took a keen interest in the poor sod. Did you go look at him? Didn't have a chance. One of the other bearers might have died. Thank you. I wonder if Sid's found anything. Oh, wait. I'm stuck over here. Wait a minute. All right, speak with Sid. I think this should be end of the quest, right? Tell me that scowl means you've got good news. S 
So, a shady lad with a hood and his equally shady lass. Not much to go on, but... But... I've been thinking, if our friend is a dominant, why not just burn the royalists to a crisp? There's a reason he's holding back, and I reckon he has something to do with his partner. What makes you say that? One of the villagers I talked to said the two were separated. If the Waluders have her, our dominants like to think twice before starting any fires. Whoever he is, he's shown himself to have a level head. He's careful, cunning, and he doesn't want to be found. This could spell trouble. For us and the Royalists both. <sighs> Still, it'll be a whole lot worse if we set off after them with bleary eyes and empty bellies. There should be a pair of pallets waiting for us back at the inn. Shall we? Party makeup has changed, okay. Now, about those beds. Beds? I seem to recall your request being to spend the night. And for that, the floor will more than suffice. Better than a wet rock, I suppose. <sighs> My thanks, Quentin. Next time you're at the hideaway, our floor's all yours. No need for thanks, Sid. This isn't an act of charity. You don't say. In exchange for my floor, I shall be requiring your services. The Royalists saw fit to erect a barricade across the road south when they occupied the village, and failed to remove it when they left. I expect it to be gone before you leave. As you wish. Expected. First time dismantling the barricade? It gets easier, don't worry. I won't. If we leave now, we'll arrive at the care when the shadows are at the deepest. Unless you'd rather wait. No more waiting. The road's south then. Unless. I know of another shortcut. You should be so lucky. Nice little, uh,. Dark video so far. I don't know if it's just me, but I have trouble seeing in the dark in this game like big time <laughs> I don't know how it looks on YouTube. We'll see I had as much filtering as, as I can you know to make the brightness up, but Wait what if the Royalists were looking to take the care that had posted centuries to prevent any unwelcome surprises, at least I would have. Well, you should know. Brightens it up a little bit, I think. Doesn't last long, though. I think overall my thoughts about the game up to this point have been... Heavy cutscenes, which is actually fine for this type of game. Uh-oh, we got some combat. There we go. Assisted finish. Okay. Yeah, the story is really good. The voice acting seems like it's one of the better voice actings I've seen this year so far, but... One thing I've been kind of noticing a trend so of is... Thinking. Hold on. Why take a stronghold they no chance of holding? When they've no intention of holding, the king is up to something. The king? Well, you don't think they're actually going to win, do you? This is one of his majesty's cunning stunts, and he sent his best to execute it. I've kind of noticed a trend lately where most PS5 games, Xbox Series X games, even on PC, it's like the frame rate always suffers a little bit. Not really sure what causes that. Oh, hold on. Keep it 
distance for it. Or maybe this is something that, like they can fix later on because just earlier this year we played uh, Star Wars. Well, that wasn't earlier this year. That was like a little while back. Jedi Survivor, you know. And it suffered the same thing. I guess just everything's different, but it doesn't take away too much. Get him, boy. Level up, let's go. I'll tell your lady you try. Seven gill, three gill, you don't get a lot. Hard not to crack even when it isn't crawling with royalists. I don't care who else is in there. I'm kind of wondering what other like party members we're gonna get. Because every Final Fantasy game you switch them out, you know? Uh oh. Get him, boy. Stay down. I love that uppercut. Oh, that was a cool combo. I didn't know you could do that in air. Interesting. First time seeing that. Okay, once the enemy flies in the air, you can just like teleport to him. Using a little, uh, little Phoenix ability. All right, quest destination nearby. Nice. Battering down the front door. I hazard this endeavor will require a bit more tact. There's an old sluice that empties under the bridge. It should see us through to the lower levels of the care. Sid. We both know why I'm here. But what is it that you want? Why would you risk your life for a handful of outcasts? If anyone ever learned what you've been doing with their property... They'd have my head in a box. But this isn't just about dominance and bearers, it's about all of us. What I want... is to build a place where it doesn't matter what you are, but who you are. But our world isn't ready for a place like that. So, until it is... I use the power I've been given to show people there is hope. This Benedicta. The best and worst decision I ever made. Don't underestimate her, Clive. A fight with her icon is not one you're likely to walk away from. Garuda. Warden of the Wind. Hey. Hmm? All right, brand new place. Here's the craziest thing about this game. We've only been playing for, okay, let's see, I did the first part about two, yeah, about a two hour experience, then hour 40. So we're almost at the four hour mark, essentially. And I feel like the game hasn't even opened up yet. All right, here we go.
One of our sentries has failed to report, milady. Your orders? Pull the men back inside the care, Geralt. He is here, then. Have them lead Sid and his little pet to the chapel. I shall entertain them there. <sighs> So you've come for me after all. All right, headwind. I love how the the game just feels like a movie. Yeah. Something. Hey, we got some light. Let's go. You'll have to teach me some time. You know, one game I'm getting vibes of while playing this, although it has nothing to do with it. They may be holding the bearers there. Sound plan. As long as we keep ourselves on this side of the bars. Plague tell. <laughs> I don't know why. Give up. Sid, this gate. Need some help. What do you think? That I'm doing most of the lifting. What? There we go. I thought I got it the first touch. Combat in this game just exceeds almost every game I've ever played as good combat. I don't know what to really compare this to. Like, obviously, you'd have to compare it to other like RPG type games, but no other one has it like this. So, where to next? to more royalists. We'd better find another one. Tell you pick. Oh, we're going here. Here we go. How about a window? I wonder if they'll bring this game to PC, you know? Right where the Royalists left. Oh, what's the first, like, thing they would port this to? Maybe PC, Xbox, I don't know. That's enough. I did a lot of damage. You know what thing I've heard people compare this like combat to, which I don't really think it's an identical type thing. Devil May Cry. Like I can see it a little bit, but that's so sick. Stay down. There's no style points for it, so <laughs> it is what it is. Get him. Get him. 
I love how quickly the music just ends. There's no fade out. Softly, it's just like, cut. Uh-oh. That did so much damage. Oh my goodness. Might be one of those games where I need to be buying potions. Oh, I haven't found that many in a while. Yeah, once you get hit by that once, tough times. Here it goes. Big damage. You can get a lot of hits in. Kind of crazy. Oh no! All right, last potion I got. There we go. Woo! Okay. Definitely need to go to the item shop if there is one in this game and buy pretty much all the potions. Because if I got a boss fight pretty soon, I'm in trouble. I never were one for heart patches, were you, Benedict? These poor sods didn't know what hit them. Ooh. Wait a minute. What did I just pick up? Scarlet Cycle. Okay, it increases it. It's pretty situational. Okay, the few I have on right now are... You know what? Keep the attack by 7. 20% healing over the 10 defense. I don't know what's better. I would guess 20%, right? Because I don't know how much 10 defense actually gives us, at least comparably speaking to what I'm currently at, you know? Two sharp things, okay. All this bloody running. Where are they going? After them. Oh no, they're gonna ring the alarm. Or sound the alarm. <laughs> Alright, well guarded. Okay, attacking an opponent from the front while it is guarding will do no damage. Okay, circle. Break the guard, okay. Seems they were expecting us. Well, this isn't good. Let me just get them out of the way first. Hold on. I might have wasted that, we'll see. That's enough. I love that little kick up. That's funny. New enemies approaching. Okay. That's such a cool combo. I love doing that. I gotta be careful because- Okay, I'm locked on too much, I feel like. Let me back up.
the enemy I have to like circle around or whatever. Maybe it's one at the end here in a minute. Ooh, that was close. Man, the combat in this game is just... The free flow combat is just amazing. There we go. Whew. That was a lot of enemies. All right, let's keep it going. Not sure if this is the right way or not. Yeah, it is. Okay. Wait, wait. Any chests around here? If there is any chests that I missed. It's only because I can't see, all right? The only way is through the chapel. Then Great Grieger must have plans for us. What? for prayer, isn't it? Do I seem so desperate as to grovel at the feet of a false god? <laughs> I was waiting for you. Not for too long, I hope. All this for a midnight chat. Well, let's chat then. Where are the men and women you took from Lost Wing? You mean, where's the dominant? Well, we shall be requiring his services indefinitely. Come back to me, Sidolphus. I need you. Think of all the things we can create together. The world that we can build. You need me. <laughs> Your king needs me. I'm all for building a new world. Just not his. That bastard's dreams are as twisted as his promises are false. And I want no part of him. King Barnabas saved you, and this is how you speak of him. Have you no shred of loyalty? What? To a leader who'd use me? Like he uses you. You know nothing of me, Sidolphus. You're right. I don't know who you are anymore. Or what you want. I only know what you used to say. That you were tired of running. That you just wanted to be free. Free of it all. You weren't lying to me then, so what changed? What made you think you had to sacrifice who you were to get what you wanted? Sacrifice? I use my talents to my advantage, and you would tell me there is shame in that? If there's no shame, then why do you feel so sorry for yourself? A rousing speech, Lord Commander. I was a fool to believe you might have changed. The only person I feel sorry for is you! I can't do this anymore. If you would stand between our leash and his dream, then you leave me no choice. Goodbye, Sidolphus. Stand back, Clive.
finish them. Well, Sid. At least it's not three against one. Get him down! I just realized I don't have any way to heal other than these little potions I got. Well, here we go. Hopefully Sid's alright, but after that thing fell on him, I don't know if he's going to make it or not. This might be tough because I don't have any healing. Oh no. They're combining forces. Cinematic evasion, that's so sick. You have a very long time to interact with it. Wait, why are we... whatever. Let's do basic slices because I felt like it auto went to the other. I don't know what's going on. What? Oh, come on. I might be dead here. Hold on, let me lock on one. That way I can just, like, at least focus up here. I'm probably dead here. One... Man, I don't have anything. I can always get him to heal me, but it's not, it's not the same. I'm my first death of the game right here. There it is. I don't really know what you're supposed to do if you... Oh wait, restart the game from last week with additional potions and... Okay. I was wondering, I was like, I could have... Easily won that fight if I just had everything with me. It is what it is. Does it replenish them though? Oh, all the way. Now that's interesting. They didn't have to do all that, but. Oh, wait, there's a checkpoint in the middle of the boss fight? Back up. Wait, what's going on? Oh, hold on. Perfect storm. I, you know what? I tried to. Uh, I'm committing right now. Hold on. Aerial dodge. Okay. I think I got it. That one I clearly got hit by. I'm just trying to just get one down at least. There we go. It'd be a lot easier when it's just a 1v1. Or really a 2v1 now. Pretty good damage, I think. 
Come on. Oh, watch out. I thought I dodged that. Damn boy. Uh, Perry. Now, why am I just seeing this for the very first time? Perry, use square just as opponent attacks to uh, parry the strike, terribly slowing time. Okay. That must have just been by accident. Get him, boy. There we go. The respawn with potions was nicely done. I feel like have you got if you got stuck right there, what do you do, you know? Ooh, what do we got? All crafting. Okay. Are you all right? Do I look all right? <coughs> Benedicta will be on her way to collect the dominant, if she hasn't already. You can't afford to let them leave. Remember, she has wings, you don't. What about you? Before or after I catch my breath. Sorry. <sighs> Come on, Toggle. I feel like Sid's gonna be in the game for a while anyway, cause hold on, can we actually interact with him more than what we just did? You grow wings yet? Then you better start climbing those stairs. Down sick guard here. Somewhere. Potion, nice. Bloody high. We get a lot of crafting materials in this game. Okay. Well, what we got? What we got? So it's for heat wave. Now I don't know if I really want to use these because it seems like you're kind of sacrificing an overall passive for that. Yeah, I think I'm gonna keep the ones I currently got. I don't want to change them. I will add it to the collections, though. Here we go. Withdraw a signal. All right, cure. Some opponents will cast cure to heal. Okay. Basically, just take them out first. So who's who's the one healing? There we go. Problem solved. <laughs> Very nice.
I mean, I guess I should probably check out my abilities and stuff. I probably have enough to upgrade the... Yeah. Almost 700 points. Okay. Here's where I don't really know. There's probably like a tier list out there yet. But if I had to guess what people are spending stuff on... Now, I don't know if you just do this one time, right? These you upgrade several times because it just says upgrade. These say master. So I don't quite know if... Hold on, I have this, but I haven't used it. Okay, hold down square to... With fire. Interesting. Oh, yeah. We... I think we should get this. So once it's mastered, you're done. Okay. And we got 500 left over for the rising flames. Here we go. Alright, so it's upgraded, but the next one's gonna cost big. 1,000. Alright, then. Oh, wait. I didn't check out the attributes. So it shows everything we're good. Okay. Uh, pedigree, normal attacks. You can also upgrade these. Man, I love the party members thing at the bottom. That's so sick. Reminds me of the old Final Fantasy games. So how does this work? Oh, that's sick. Ooh, let's go, baby. It's weird. You, you can't hold it down before actually. So you have to swing, but you have to hold it down afterwards. That's so cool. Okay. I think I'm going the wrong way. Is there a local map? Hey, what is this? Meteorite. Okay. Somebody asked me why is Final Fantasy VII my favorite. Uh, it was mainly because it was my very first one I ever played. I thought the first time I played ten was excellent. Okay, we're already back to where we were. Sid's probably still there. Uh, let's just keep going up. I got sidetracked. At least we found that other thing. Let's just go right, go across here. A little light. Here we go. Now we're going up. Yeah, the fact that if you lose a fight, you respawn with all potions is pretty good. I'm running out of tower. Our lady wants us gone before sunrise. <laughs> Get him, boy. That does so much damage. Oh, so. Well, not that much. The finishers seem to do a lot more. That's some quick XP. 20 right there. Okay, we can go down here or we can... Wait, there's something down here. Are right, we get another potion. Nice. I've heard this game has a new game plus. It's like pretty well designed. I haven't seen anything about it though. I've just heard good things. I was kind of reading some reviews before I started playing today, and it was exactly what I was expecting. A lot of cutscenes, great story, great voice acting, combats, you know, top tier, all that. Uh oh. That's a lot of enemies. I was actually surprised they're all gonna fight. Okay. Wait a minute. So it's just like holding down the uh there we go. That's enough. Get him. That does so much damage to everybody. Get him. Oh, I gotta get around this enemy. I'll save that one for last. Stay down. It does actually, nice. Kind of staggers them. 
wonder how long you can hold this down for. We always find two sharp things every time. That ain't good. Hold on, let me get this other one first. I just realized everybody has a level, but the leveling system in this game is not like you can do a lot of side stuff, really. At least not right now, you know? Almost. Almost! There it is. I'm just gonna do basic attacks here, because everything else seems to be kinda... Doesn't do as much over time, you know? That ain't good. There we go. Woo, okay. This feels like a side area. Hold on. High potion, I'll take it. Oh no, maybe not. The green tower, okay. That first enemy just got absolutely obliterated. <laughs> Finally. Uh, what? 